Hello world, welcome to CyberCrete and today in this video we are going to see how you can get a HackerRank JavaScript certificate that is completely for free and we are going to solve one question for it and then we are going to receive the certificate. So let us start. So first of all we are just going to head towards this link and we are basically going to create the account and here you can see that we have the two questions that we have to basically solve so we are going to solve this very first one and let us just basically try to read this instructions here uh, in this question uh, what we have to basically do is that we are given a javascript object and it is basically a key value pair like we have basically in any dictionary or in hash map if you have learned any other programming language or if you have learned python it is basically dictionary if you have learned javascript it is basically map or c++ it is also hash map but here we are basically in the given question if you can basically read we are given this key value pair and we have to basically delete the key that we are basically asked and in the question here you can see that you have to return a new object in which that particular key that it is asked for is going to be deleted means it is not going to exist so here you can see the example like in this foo bar foo bar and foo bar and here you are given at the very end foo which means we have to delete this foo key from our dictionary or hash map whatever you will like to say so well just to be clear this is very easy question and i don't think that how it is basically going to test someone's javascript skills because it is just one line command that we are going to see and here is basically the driver code that we have already given to us means we don't have to even write that it will just delete the key so how we are going to delete the key let us basically see here let us see one more example in this example also you can see that you are given certain keys and you are basically asked to delete them so by seeing the example we have to get some basic idea and once we get that idea let us now try to code this solution out so for doing that what we can basically do we have the object which is named as ovj and okay to delete this we can basically i think in javascript we have to basically write delete object so yes let us here i just simply wrote delete object and the object name is prop and i just returned that object and as you can see our test cases have run successfully and now after our final submission we can see that we have successfully completed all the public and as well as all the private test cases and this is the next question in which we have to basically deal with the class but just to be sure i am not a javascript expert but i just knew how we can basically delete the key so i was able to solve that question and i was able to get the certificate because if you are going to solve basically one question then you are basically eligible for getting certified from this hacker uh, platform and here on this question you can basically see that it is basically going to ask us to create a class which have this certain properties like this we have inside our class we have to add this add method as well as this rename method as well as this get str method but i think it is if you are someone who basically know javascript then you can basically go there continue to write the code but if you just want to solve this question too then you can basically also try to look up to google if you don't have no familiarity with javascript whatsoever and then you can just look out how you are basically going to implement these classes and objects in a javascript and if you are familiar to programming it won't take longer than five to six minutes to do that and once you did that you can come to this platform write your code and it will work perfectly fine but for the sake of this video we don't need to just write the second code to get certified with just a single code successful run we are going to get the certificate so let me just submit it and i will click yes thanks and test is submitted successfully and you can see here now we have to just wait for like five to six minutes or sometime half an hour or maximum of one hour and i will just fast forward this video and i will show you that i actually get the certificate here 
so here you can see that i have got the certificate that we are talking about so how cool is that you can basically share to linkedin share to the facebook and just we are getting certificate to solve a single question so this is it for this video and if you like this video please make sure to subscribe to our channel and if you want to get certified in python or uh, rest api you can see my previous video bye bye